Hey men moving forward, as we continue our journey um, through the heart of man, we today looking at chapters 5 and 6 of A Shepherd's Look at Psalm 23. Amazing chapters. For me, these are some of the most important verses in the whole thing. And looking in to chapter 5, I was talking about um, that God restores our soul. What an incredible picture about the shepherd and the sheep. And I'm just learning like crazy what this means, that we really are sheep. And that God really is our shepherd. And that he's not mad at us when we find ourselves in trouble, needing restoration. He's actually compassionate, eager to help, pursuing us. And uh, he's got a stake in our health. And so he wants us healthy. And he's looking out for uh, predators and our own mistakes. And uh, um, that's assuring to me to live life knowing that God's for me, not against me. But also, in chapter 6, when we're rolling into and he guides us in paths of righteousness for his namesake, just that reality that, you know what, there, there really is truth to the fact that I can be stiff-necked. As a matter of fact, one of my friends recently has been telling me I'm stiff-necked. Um, and uh, what happened to me physically is a few weeks ago, I became stiff-necked. I don't know how, but I've been having to go to the chiropractor to get my neck work on. And I was like, man... This is really interesting. I've been stiff-necked in my body, and maybe I've been stiff-necked in my spirit, in my in my thinking, and having to say, God, listen, I need to believe that you are the best, you want the best for me, and that you really will guide me if I'll simply surrender to you. And add those seven areas of learning how to surrender to God so that we're not stiff-necked sheep. Man, super good. If you haven't had time to look at these chapters, guys, it's such an easy read, but it just continues to get deeper and richer. Stay on the journey with us. We're halfway there, and then we're going to be ready to roll before you know it into June 26th. So keep it going. God bless you. If you have any questions or needs, please let us know.